now we are going to study how to prepare stock solution that means 1000 ppm of stock solution for various metal compounds mixing of 1 gram of metal element in 1 liter of water which will give 1000 ppm of stock but the problem is metals are not alone for in the case of cadmium the cadmium never occur in nature in its elemental form so it's always found in a compound form with other element for example cadmium in the form of cadmium chloride cadmium nitrate and cadmium sulfate compound therefore we are not using to mixing of 1 gram of compound in 1 liter of water to prepare 1000 ppm of stock due to the nature of elements available in compound form we are using a formula molecular weight divided by atomic weight to prepare 1000 ppm of the stock in the case of cadmium chloride the molecular weight of the compound we can see it in a reagent bottle that means molecular weight of cadmium chloride is 201.32 in the case of atomic weight of cadmium the element we are going to prepare uh, 1000 ppm of stock so we can find out the atomic weight of cadmium simply in a periodic table of the element or simply we can google it and find out the atomic weight of the cadmium based on this formula molecular weight of the compound divided by atomic weight of the element so we are getting the value of 1.790 gram which is mixing with 1 liter of water so this one will give 1000 ppm of stock if you take 1.790 uh, gram of cadmium chloride compound which means it contain 1 gram of cadmium and 0.790 gram of other elements therefore in this compound 1 gram of cadmium we need to prepare the 1000 ppm of stock so if you take 1.790 gram of the compound which means the element cadmium amount is 1 gram therefore if you are mixing with 1 liter of water which will give 1000 ppm of stock for the preparation of different concentrations from the stock we are using the formula required concentration multiplied by required volume divided by stock based on this formula required concentration multiplied by required volume divided by stock for example we are going to prepare 10 ppm of the solution from 1000 ppm of stock so we are using the formula this is the required concentration 10 ppm required volume is 100 ml divided by 1000 ppm of stock so where we are getting the value uh, the value 1 ml so therefore taking 1 ml of the solution from the 1000 ppm of stock and mixing with 99 ml of water that means we are using to we are uh, our volume is required volume is 100 ml therefore we are adding 99 ml of water to make 100 ml which will give 10 ppm of the required concentration of solution if you need to prepare 240 ppm 240 ppm the same formula we are also applying here that means the required concentration is 240 ppm and required volume is 100 ml divided by stock so we are getting the vol value 24 ml that means taking or mixing 24 ml of solution from the stock 1000 ml mixing with 76 ml of water which will give 
120 ppm of required concentration. If you need 250 ml of the required volume, in that case, in this formula we are using 10 ppm that is required concentration of uh, solution and multiplied by required volume is 250 ml divided by stock. So, the results we are getting 2.5 ml from the stock taking 2.5 ml of solution from the stock 1000 ppm mixing with 247.5 ml of water that means why because our required volume is 250 ml therefore 2.5 ml of stock mixing with 247.5 ml of water we make it to 250 ml which will give 10 ppm of the required concentration. If the required concentration is less than 10 ppm that means 0 0.1 ppm to 8 ppm in that case it is recommended to prepare secondary stock solution that means secondary stock is 100 ppm. So, the same formula we are using to make uh, 100 ppm of stock that means the required concentration is 100 ppm and the required volume is 100 ml. So, based on the requirement you can increase the volume divided by stock that means 1000 ppm. So, here we are getting 10 ml the result is 10 ml therefore, taking 10 ml of solution from the stock mixing with 90 ml of water which will give 100 ppm of secondary stock. If the required concentration is less than 1 ppm in that case of uh, 0 0.01 to 0 0.0 0 0.1 ppm in that case it is recommended to prepare the stock of 10 ppm that is next level of stock. So, based on the required concentration you will make the stock. So, based on the requirement we can make the stock solution. In the case of low level required concentration for example, 0 0.1 ppm to 8 ppm we are using the stock 100 ppm. So, the same formula we are using here to prepare required concentration of 0 0.1 ppm it is multiplied by 100 ml of that is required volume of uh, solution divided by the stock is 100 ppm. In that case we are taking 0 0.1 ml of solution from the 100 ppm of stock mixing with 99 ml of water which will give 0 0.1 ppm of the required concentration. In the case of uh, 8 ppm the required concentration preparation of required concentration of 8 ppm the same formula we are using 8 ppm required concentration multiplied by required volume 100 ml divided by the stock is secondary stock is 100 ppm. So, we are getting the result of 8 ml. So, that means taking 8 ml of solution from the stock 100 ppm mixing with 92 ml of water which will give 0 0.8 ppm of the required concentration.